Okay. Why are we having Red Snake it on on a green on a green team? No, I don't know. That's Red a Mega Snake Man character. And yellow <laughs> Mega, Mega Man. Mega No. Well, this isn't gonna be annoying. I don't know, call it Banana Mega Man, I guess. But <laughs> all right, going straight into it. Already leading off with tons of percent on Lucina for a Mega Man. Yeah, Yoshi's downer just does so much shield pressure and damage. Gets him back off stage with the jabs as well, and Spiker can go hunting as Fair will break him out of Cypher. All right, Jolt trying to control uh, space here, but uh, Synergy doing super well at just keeping him out. Has to use the jump to avoid the grenade. And... All right, not able to connect with a forward smash there. A little bit misplaced. And sends his teammate back with a fair on the fair. Joel just aiming for that with the dancing blade. Honestly, I thought he was going to dance the blade one into forward smash there, because that definitely would have taken the stock. But Snake losing his first stock there, Skyga. One first up to lose the stock. Into the upper and the dancing blade after. Spiker going to be forced to go. But Skydra has to recover meanwhile. All right, gets a forward smash on the tech in the... Oh, uh, tech in place, my bad. Uh, try to land with upper, you're not roaring from. Spiker standing that. right on the C4, but Skydra wasn't in any position to detonate it. But he was still able to convert into a stock, getting the stock off of Jolt with the Nikita. Skydra going for the back air what and succeeding. Heck? All right, getting the down throw, not gonna be able to get any conversion off of it. He just leaves you later and swinging for a swing and it's even stocks. Skydra gladly taking that stock off of Jolt. The kamikaze forward air. I believe he fast fell that to get the timing and just unable to throw out the Cypher in time, but. Yeah, definitely. A little bit too low for Cypher to come out. He has grenade in hand holding shield and he hits the Yoshi and gets the back air off of the conversion. Interrupting the F-Smash with the dash attack. What a great first option Snake has. Jolt, you're so brave for game, staying off stage, honestly. Jolt I, attempting to help his teammate. Uh, mid, awkward place for Smash at the very beginning. Uh, if Spiker had dropped, that was definitely Spiker's stop there. Ooh, not able to get the C4 read on, uh, on Jolt there. Yeah, I believe that C4 wasn't necessarily to hit anyone, just to get a new one off in the center of the platform or in the center of the stage with the platforms gone. All right, that's the up smash read. Very nice call out on the jump and three stock already. Another restock and the game is mad even. Yeah, one teammate at above 100, the other at pretty much zero. All right, gotta watch out. You got Snake up to worry about. Actually, you got Snake everything to worry about. Yeah, Lucina back air though, gonna be threatening. And now it's gonna be Jolt versus Skydra for this one. All right, not able to, not able to really control stage as much as he wants to with this grenade until continuing to get exploded as soon as he touches him. Able to F smash without getting hit by the mortar as well. Air dodges back, Cypher not connecting, and the Dancing Blade applying more damage onto Skydra. That was a really good, uh, really well-placed Dancing Blade as well, but he's got to get back to stage. Does get him with the reverse angle down uh, shield breaker there. Uh, watch out, he's got grenade in hand and not able to catch him on the recovery. Drops well, aiming with the down tilt, but had enough in All right, gonna throw the grenade to the other side of the stage. Oh. No jump? That was unfortunate. Small anti-climax for that one, but Skydra and Jolt, meanwhile. Yeah, and Skydra, uh, Spiker and Jolt are or, like sorry, doing, yes. Spike and Joel are doing like pretty well for the tools that they're given, especially against such a campy team such as Mega Man and, and, uh, uh, and Snake. But it seems like Skydra is being allowed to set up his his traps more easily than he should be, especially with the destroyance that Lucina has. It yeah. Seems like they're trying to fight the wrong characters. I agree. I believe these two matchups would be better if they just reversed course and went yes. the other way. All right, we're going to be starting off Mega Man in the front. He's going to throw out the pellets first. No Metal Blade coming out. There's the Metal Blade and gets a Leaf Shield, gets hit. Oh, he didn't toss around like a ragdoll a little bit. Four times the Leaf Shield actually not interrupting Skydra. Down air, final hit. 
Getting him with the dash attack there, not able to get No, he didn't get the turnaround up and instead Dancing Blade ones and doesn't have a double jump to count to count for it. Crucial mistake. Synergy very close to dying there, but using the side platform to refresh his jump and air dodges around the F smash too. Synarchy doing super well, holding on to the stock here. Heavy boy from Mega Man here, fighting robot. Metal Blade, no, not able to connect, but he does get the uh, flame slash after the down throw. Up tilt and the grenade afterwards from Skydra, just doing so much damage onto Spiker. All right, throwing out these tornadoes just to make sure he could get a jump read. Double parry on the explosives. Yeah, just caught Jolt lounging on top of the C4 and Ooh, gets... immediately after he's dead. Oh God, drop down forward smash, true combo from Lucina's. All right, Snake having a bit of a, a trouble coming back and there's the back air for his troubles. Spiker out of a jump, but able to land on the side platform. Those Mega Man up airs were just doing so much mental damage and the back air afterwards. It seems like uh, like Jolt's trying to uh, trying to compensate for his lost stock, pressing a little bit too many buttons here, getting himself hit way too much than he should be. Spiker jumps right into that nair though. Looks like he, he wanted to catch him with an air master there, but that forward smash not gonna kill again. Snake Heavy Boy has a lot of equipment on him. Spiker just jumping around, interrupted slightly by the leaf shield, but still in a very good position. I lands with the dancing blade four. Not able to get the back air read. Gets hit by the grenade as he tries to punch the snake. Ford smashes Synarchy back off stage. No down air to kill. Dash attack and the mortar actually gonna connect onto Spiker. All right, Synarchy's still living. Heavy blow for Mega Man. All right, we got the, oh wow. Crash Bomber actually transferred to Snake there. Oh, both tried to uh, counter the reads there, but Spiker caught in middle of a rock and a hard place. Yeah, and if you're Jolt here, you cannot die before Spiker does because I feel like Lucina is much better equipped for handling a 2v1 than Yoshi would be. Yeah, definitely here. And that leaf shield, no! There goes the stock. Hard knuckle, not gonna kill, but the C4 does on the accidental detonation on Synergy. And there's the upper. Yeah, Yoshi's gonna have to take this one by himself now as Skydra makes it back. Roll actually not getting caught by the strong hit of the Yoshi Bomber. Yeah, that was actually surprising. I expected Yoshi Bomb to catch him that time. There's the grenade. Okay, he didn't double jump very smart from, from Spiker there. He's gotta get back. No, he drifted too far. Expending too many resources, trying to live, not able to recover in time. Yeah, just a, a quick mental lapse. And you could tell Spiker ran out of room there. The side platforms weren't available to him, and yeah. even if he wanted to go high, probably gonna have to maneuver around at least a grenade or Nikita to make it back. Yeah, and he had to maneuver around uh, the pellets mm -hmm. that uh, that that Synarchy was throwing out uh, very inconspicuously in between his crash bombers, his metal blades, and then at in occasion his leaf shields. Then you had Nikita setups from uh, who was it? Skydra, right? From Skydra. Yeah, yes. from Skydra. Uh, There's just a lot of explosions that that Yoshi had to deal with. And one of those was the really well-placed grenades that Skyjack threw out at him. Always holding, cooking it for a little bit before he threw it. In addition to that, you already had C4 placed on the stage as well. So you can't necessarily go freely past the ledge because yeah. you could be landing directly into where Snake wants you to land. Yeah, and there there was just a lot of good setup play for both Synarchy and